If everyday low prices and quality products matter to you, then come to Consulates on Bush Road, number 72, St. Martin. At Consulates, you can buy the highest quality food and household products, frozen foods, dairy products, snacks, laundry and cleaning products, housewares, and just about every other thing under the sun. Our customer service is just simply the best. So kids need the shoppers. Visit www.costyouless.com or visit our store on St. Martin and we'll help you ship your items. Cost you less. Your best value warehouse store. The Grenadian who was on the run from authorities in St. Martin and was caught in St. Kitts has been handed over to Dutch authorities. According to information obtained by SK Newsline, the man Catherine Cucci Fortune was deported to St. Martin on Thursday evening in the custody of Dutch officials. The action came 48 hours after Commissioner of Police Ian Quigley told reporters at the Prime Minister's recent press conference that Fortune would be facing more charges in addition to those he had read to him, and he would likely serve his time before leaving the island. Authorities in St. Martin, in a statement obtained by SK Newsline, confirmed the deportation. The statement read, On the 29th of July 2017, Catherine Cucci Fortune was arrested by law enforcement authorities of St. Kitts and Nevis for illegal entry into the territory of St. Kitts and Nevis, the St. Martin Police Force was informed of the arrest of Catherine Fortune. On the 4th of August 2017, the Public Prosecutor's Office in St. Martin was informed that the Public Prosecutor on St. Kitts and Nevis brought Fortune before the Summary Court. The Summary Court ruled that Fortune gained illegal entry into the territory of St. Kitts and Nevis and subsequently ruled that he should be deported as an illegal alien. An order to deport Fortune was signed by the Prime Minister of St. Kitts and Nevis. As Catherine Fortune travelled from St. Martin to St. Kitts and Nevis previously, and also has Dutch nationality, authorities on St. Kitts and Nevis decided to return Fortune to St. Martin. That announcement has left many in the Federation baffled that he was made to leave Ireland without serving his time. Fortune, who was charged with murder in St. Martin, escaped lawful custody after he was taken to a Cahill clinic. According to reports, the man held two guards at gunpoint and escaped the facility. He turned up at a beach in Connery, on Saturday, July 29th, SK Newsline has learned that the residents in the area witnessed unusual activities and alerted police. Law enforcement officials found Fortune with a number of illegal items, including a Bush Master firearm, compressed marijuana, and a quantity of cash. According to St. Martin authorities, on the 4th of August 2017, Catherine was taken over by law enforcement personnel from St. Martin and brought back to the Point Blanche prison, where he will serve the remainder of his 21 years prison sentence, rendered against him for the murder of Irvin Margarita in 2006. Andre Huey, SKN Newsline.